out here. Hello, hello. Uh, welcome to the Split My Channel. This is Adiba and today I will break down another very sexy sample I made. I have a new camera. It's even worse than my iPhone 7, but we out here. Uh, before we start, make sure to follow me on like the social medias posted somewhere on the screen. And subscribe to the Split My Channel and like the video and hit the notification bell thing because it does help a lot. It does help a lot. So yeah, I would say the most important thing about this style is to like keep a good sound selection and a chord progression. So for sound selection, you want to find like sounds that are warm and vintage. So for example, some analog synths that have like that vintage type to it, but like warm type to it, you know, like a lot of them do that, do have that, but like, but yeah. So after that, you're going to create some bouncy chords that have like cool inversions and are big and I will like show you. And next thing to have is like a nice percussion loop that's also add a lot processing to make it like more vintage okay so firstly i gotta plug myself in i dropped a new kit it's called astrogate it's a stars and a midis collection and you have like a lot of starters and midis obviously guitar leads vocals uh midis like i have them in the sections you know we're that organized here on drama 5 so here i went to this midi and i dragged it here so now we have this melody so i use this pad from the Estrella bank and this is how it sounds And also, I'm gonna leave a free download link for this uh, MIDI in the description. But if you don't download it, you can also screenshot it and copy, do whatever you want with it. So, without the effects. So, I made it sound really like vintage and out in the background. So, I have EQ, a couple EQs. I have Shaperbox, this filter, and this volume. So, without this filter. So it kind of like cuts it off to create like more movement, I guess. I have this and I have J37 Mono, this aquarium preset. A, a really famous preset a lot of sample makers use and I have it like turned down um, halfway. Moving on, next are these 4AM bells, also from the same bank. It's Estrella Bank from the 4 floor. I use these keys to give it like a nice texture, so... Without the effects. We have EQ, we have Brower Motion Stereo, I love this plugin, Psychedelic Chorus from Waves, and it's kind of like a panning and a chorus, it's a chorus, yeah, but it's like panning and a stereo, you know, get it, get it. We also have Shaperbox, this, and we have Wow Control, Vinyl, to create like a vinyl. So what's really important here is the sound selection and the chords and the bounce of the chords. So for the sound selection, I decided to use a really like vintage type of sounds. And for example, these bells, they're like sparkly, but this they still have that like vintage feel to them. So like I would say warm analog instruments, like synths, stuff like that. And the chord progression make like big chords and make it like have a nice rhythm to it. So you can create like normal chords and then you can like hold shift and then like see what type of like bounce you want. Also you can strum chords and also keep in mind you can go crazy with the, what is it called, the uh, inversions. So like for example this, instead of this, we decided to like pitch it up and you can just like keep adding notes that are in the scale. For example this is a nice chord, I just like added these notes. Uh, Echo Boy, this preset. Portal, water from Stevens Bank, uh, Stevens and Pilgrims Bank. Next thing is this bass, also from the same bank, and uh, it's just copy of the root notes. Like a little variation. So we have this plugin and uh, a little EQ without the effect. It's a slight difference, but like it adds something. Later, I added this percussion loop from X, Y, Nothing. It's like a subtle, but it really added a lot to the sample. So definitely use percussion loops if you can, if it fits. Next thing, I pulled this from Splice. It's just like little strings. Um, we have 
EQ and EQ and uh, this vinyl, Creamy Strings preset. This is how everything sounds together. And I honestly didn't like strings so much, so I like this part. So after everything, I pissed it up. And I think it really, really sounds good and a lot better pitched up. So this is how it sounds with everything. This is the full sample. So yeah, that's pretty much the whole sample. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate you as, as always. Go cop my new kit on dramafy.com. And yeah, also join the Discord in the description if you want to like talk to me more and stuff like that.